hello, hello, hello. I, I am here. I am, I am, I am here. So. <laughs> I had to, I had to launch this just to change the resolution and this is so, this looks so stupid. But at the same time, I fucking love it. Now, my only question is how well is the... Okay, uh, so that surprised me a little bit. Uh, I wasn't expecting chapters, nor was I expecting it to actually have the whole game. For the simple reason of this is listed as early access on the mod page. So I assumed that this would not be finished, but apparently it is. Oh, this is atrocious. Holy shit. Um, uh, put one where M brought in, but. Oh, okay, right. <laughs> I was, I wasn't ready for it just to fucking start like that. Uh, I was expecting some kind of of opening, but no, we're just we're just straight. In. These are literally just half life two zombies. I swear I've seen that pistol model before as well. The buttons are set up wrong. Uh. One second as I use my incredibly strange uh, keybinds for everything. And you. Okay, wait. 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 There's. There's no. There's literally like no binds, what? Unbind E. Yes, I use V to interact. Fuck you. There's no. What's this face in here? Yeah, it's been quite some time since I actually. <laughs> oh my fucking god. Since I actually played the original Resident Evil 2. Uh, the last time I did that was on stream, but my god, that fucking swear is ridiculous. I need to get like a shotgun. I swear that you're supposed to be able to get a weapon in here, but. I guess because the uh, arm stealer was not there, it's just not going to work. How, how, how much thought did they put into this? Not much. Okay. I wonder if the secret where you... um. Yeah, this is... They did not think this through. <laughs> like, it, it, I was expecting them to have removed the uh, thingy. Uh, the the uh, jump button, but no, they didn't. I feel like this is not going to be designed with like jumping in mind, so that's kind of going to suck. Oh, yeah, there's no thingy then. There's no what's his face. No what's his face to kill and get a key from to access the secret locker, but that's fine. Actually, you're not supposed to pick up anything for that secret, are you? I don't remember. It's been ages since I've, since I've played Resident Evil 2, so I don't remember. But this is a long fucking loading screen. Have they put the entire RPD in one map? Is that what they've done? Because that's cool if they have, but at the same time, this is a long loading screen. Uh oh, okay. <laughs> Fucking incredible. Oh my god. I like how it, how it's got a pot for an arm. That's some creative uh creative model use. Holy shit. Ink ribbon. Thank you. They've actually done the entire fucking RPD, haven't they? I was about to go through there, but no, they that's not how it works in the original game, is it? Yeah, that door's locked. I think this is the first one you have to go through. No, wait. Yeah, it's completely different in the original game. It's been so long. No, uh, Leon sign. Disappointed. Our attention to these. Uh, is there no inventory either? I'm assuming herbs just instantly heal you is what they do. Yeah, it looks like they do. Okay, I I'm gonna I'm gonna try and go through this without right clicking because I feel like that's like that gives you an indicator of how much health and ammo you have, which I feel like is uh, not very uh, not very cool for this. Liquor. Sad. No liquor. Them brains in this universe? Holy shit. There's an item box, but I... <laughs> it doesn't do anything. Okay. Yeah, this isn't really a... as big of a problem. <laughs> you can just jump on the fucking table. I mean, 
it, it looks exactly. I mean, I'll, I'll give them credit for uh, managing to make it look exactly like the. Uh... So that's the thingy one. Managing to make it look exactly like the original game. This is surprisingly, surprisingly good recreate. I can't jump over that. Okay. I mean, I I, I should just be able to, you know, jump. And jump over that and get through the window, but it's cool. That breaks the game flow, so not allowed to do that. I don't want to get in that. I swear there's something in that room that I need, but lock pull combination. Uh, well, this is not fun. Let me out, please. Wow, this is not where I wanted to be. Okay. <laughs> Oh, are you serious? I'll try the thing I was wanting to try again then, uh, which was seeing if... I can never remember who it is. It's the helicopter pilot from the first game. I never remember who he is though. There we go. I'll see if that actually does happen if you just don't pick up anything. These look so fucking goofy. I want to save it then, because... Oh, no way, I have to use the fucking room. What am I talking, what am I talking about? I, I really want to just get in there, but... Yeah, no. That's not happening. The thing that I'm most curious about is if the, um... That secret is actually recreated or not, but... Fuck, I picked up hammer. Oh, well. Let me through, please. Thank you. Yeah, I, I, I guess uh, I guess there might be no way to not do that then. So the secret probably isn't the thing. Oh, if you're a, if you summon tier three, you get this star. Oh, and there's some cool paper cuts. Hold on, that's not a zombie because that's just a fucking dead body. Yeah, that's a, that's a zombie from Left 4 Dead. I'm pretty sure. That one is a zombie. The thing that worries me is like, hold on, how about you? Can I get past you? Yeah. Fuck it. We're gonna do a dance for a minute. Yeah, that's way more effective. I mean, I figured it would be, but... Interrogation room, that one's locked. That one shouldn't be locked. Yep. Uh... What's actually in there? I don't remember. Is that one of the plugs? That's one of the plugs, yeah. Because the plugs in the original game were in a different order to the ones in the remake. Okay, so that's this bit? I guess there's no dollar. Off stairs. I forgot there's no stairs. What is the purpose of this like, fucking item box? I... I don't understand. Okay. We're gonna get... Oh my god, they're antlions! <laughs> Holy shit! Ah, fuck. I'm just gonna do that. Ooh. That is incredible. I was not ready for them to be antlions. <laughs> See, here's the thing. They didn't actually, like, do anything special from what I'm aware. They just replaced the enemies from, uh... <laughs> from Resident Evil with random Half-Life enemies that somewhat fit the same purpose, and that's it. Funny donation bot go shashi over the boom share. Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, that's the save room. Good. Yeah, let's see how it's like. So, do I actually need any new Phineas and Herb? <laughs> Sorry, I'm just making up shitty jokes myself now. So maybe, maybe that, you can unlock that then. Maybe not, actually. Oh, there is ammo in there, cool. Dark room. I don't have anything to do in here, though. I'm just going to end up holding a uh, fucking increments because I have no idea how many I have. That's the doll with the broken light. Wait, don't tell me I have to actually do this puzzle. What? Wait, what? It just pushes itself? Uh... Uh... Yeah, this is how pushing things works, don't worry about it. 
Please tell me it has the stars music. This isn't the stars room music. Actually, it might be. I might, I might be thinking of the cutscene music. Never mind. Gun. Oh yeah, you can't. Okay, I'll take that. <laughs> Fucking projected the image that's supposed to be there on the wall. Incredible. Wait, can you search the desk 50 times? Hold on. Wait, 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 there's, there's a locker key? Wait, what? I really want to know if you can search the desk 50 times. I don't know which part you'd have to search though for it. I, I don't think the dark room even works in this version, I'll be honest. Shotgun. That is a... The model FOV? Uh, 6C. Wow, that is... I can barely even see it, the default FOV. Fuck. There's a lot of that mo- Whoa, there is so much of this model! What? Why can you barely see those? Oh my god, the stock just extends fucking infinitely. Are you serious? You can see, like, actually, that looks terrible in my now. I understand why it's limited to that now. Never mind, that does, that does, look, re that does look really bad. Like, you've got this high quality. Co I swear to god that I've seen this model before. I think this is taken from a different mod, and I don't know which one, but I've seen this model before. I think you have. Two cylinders and a rectangle. My favourite, my favourite shotgun model in any video game. Instantly. Uh, there's that. I shouldn't have taken that. I am fucking stupid. Good. Uh, there's nothing else in here. I swear I've seen this knife model before as well. I, I, I swear that's all... I swear I've seen, like, both of these in Gary's mod before. This was, like, a crowbar replacement. This was a pistol replacement, obviously. This has to be a model that they made for this mod. These two definitely are things that people have made before. Like, years and years and years ago. This was still nice to be part of a different game, to be honest. I don't know what it would be from there. Library! I don't remember how to solve this puzzle. Uh, I honestly do not. Uh, the floor should break when I walk over here. Yeah, I wonder if the floor's gonna break. Wow, it broke. Ah, I wasn't expecting that at all. Crazy. Okay, so it's... I'm gonna have to fucking actually get out to do that. So... That one's right, that one's right. Oh yeah, it's literally just you move those two, isn't it? And then, then you're done. Yeah, that's all you do, you just move those two. Bishop plug. Real homies only care about the rook plug. It's over here. Unicorn metal. I need that. Release that. Emergency ladder. So that should have gone down now. Oh, thank God there's a, like, a snapping point on that, because that would be awful otherwise. Jesus Christ. I, I was scared for a second that I'd have to deal with source engine and ladder shenanigans, but no. Uh, lighter. Lighter. I can go back. What's in there? I have no clue what that was, but, um, sure. This door should be openable now. That doesn't look right at all, but sure, we'll, we'll go with it. Oh, it still uses the... it still uses the suit energy system because I just stopped sprinting abruptly. Cool. Uh... Oh yeah, there's the upper upper floor. What's actually up here? Oh, the clock tower room, right? Wow, yeah, Jesus. I need to fucking put that knife away because it's taking up so much of the screen, I can't see anything. Isn't this supposed to be like a... a hole in the wall? Or am I... Oh, that might be up there. Oh no, it's up there. Damn, there's an axe in there. I want that axe. Oh, I'm thinking of the remake. No, the, the helicopter comes crashing through the wall in the remake here. Yeah, but... No, it's birds in this one, which are mad. <laughs> Watch out for the fucking T-posing birds, holy shit. Oh. The mad hack birds, I was not ready. Is that all of them? Why is the music still going? Oh, there is still one. Okay. <laughs> Fucking manhag birds. That is incredible. Uh, okay. 
There's the valve. I didn't want to save, I wanted to pick up that, but sure, I'll save here. I should have opened that door, because that door is kind of funny in the original game. And I want to see if there's just two zombies behind it in this one. Yeah, there's just two zombies behind it. Is the door going to close itself? Oh, yeah, it will. And I'm never going back out there again. Uh, this room is a cool room. Ribbon. Diamond key, diamond key, let's go. King plug. I swear that's from like CSS or something. I don't remember. I think I can open that door down there now, right? Oh, yeah, yeah, absolutely. Oh, I can open the locker thing as well. Wait, it's just that one that opens? Phineas and Herb. I keep thinking Phineas and Herb and it's, it's not funny. Oh, I can open that now. Okay, let's go. Yeah, so I want to go back through here again. That's a spade door. Where the fuck can I actually go now? I can put that in. Which vomits the spade key. Cool. Uh, is this just going to push itself? Oh, well, it actually only pushes itself from one direction. Cool. Crank. Yeah, the crank is for this. I don't have the gear for that. And um, that's something that opens later, so... No, that's diamond key. Don't need that. Odd. And, and I'm leaving! Yep, yeah, because I knew that was coming. Why did you leave? Fuck you! Okay, good. You've moved. I can just jump over that, that guy. See ya! Oh, these are the dogs. Right. That, that makes sense that the dogs would be fast zombies. Also, no air to, it's, um, no cutscene. Sad. Uh, I don't believe you actually leave at all in this version. I'm trying to remember if these get knocked open. There's a herb at the end. Maybe, but I don't need the herb, so. It's already unlocked. Is it? No. Oh. Rubber. Sorry, manhole opener. Yeah, okay, sure. Uh, I'm gonna go back up first, actually, I think. And take a look. No, it's locked, isn't it? Are there any doors that I haven't gone through yet? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh... There's a zombie behind the door, and I can't open it. I'm just gonna walk away then. I'll go do this bit first. Oh, you can't move those. I don't know what I just picked up, but sure. So this is where you're supposed to have the, like, Ada section, right? Except there's no Ada section, I'm guessing, so... There's, like, no point in being down here then. Uh... Okay, I guess I'm... Huh. Oh my god! Hmm. Okay, I guess I have to do the... the manhole bit. Why? Why are you like this? Wait, respirator. Oh wait, this should be the first Birkin fight, right? Yeah, I'm pretty sure the first Birkin fight is like right here. So I should probably make sure I'm prepared for that. I don't know if there is actually going to be a Birkin fight or not though. Can I just crouch under this? Okay, actually this might be the air section. No, this is the air section. I guess you can just crouch under it, because... Yeah, because it normally, <laughs> normally goes through there. Yeah. So I guess because there's no different characters, it's just... I'm guessing that this isn't going to be able to push sideways, yeah. These are all just perfectly aligned.
Well, key. Okay, now I have all the keys. Where does this go? I don't remember where this goes. Oh, right. Yeah, yeah. That's where it connects up to Sherry. You know, because that's Sherry's section. Now I remember now. Oh, Emma. Yeah, because that, that hole is where Sherry comes through. But that's where Ada comes through. That bit. Oh, I remember now. I should have probably saved before or after doing that. Yeah, that was stupid. I'm gonna go do some other stuff first then so that I feel like that wasn't totally uh, a waste. Good. Why? This one? That unlocks? I remember this room. I think I died in that room when I actually played the original game. Because this room is just a complete clusterfuck. Uh, there's the keycard. Uh, why did that fall off? I... Yeah, oh, why not? Cool. Hammer. Flares. Don't need those. Okay, this model definitely looks out of place compared to the rest. It's so fucking big. Yeah, th these are just models taken from different places. Also, I swear I recognise that model as well. That might be another one that was used in, like, a Gary's Mod thing at some point. It was the save room up here, right? Yeah. Uh, there should be a magnum on my back here, right? Oh, no, that's where you get the magnum. That is a strange looking model as well. So is it, has this opened up now or is it still blocked? I'm gonna have to no clip at some point. Right, so I can go back down to to section again and assuming that the Birkin fight is actually there, uh, I'm gonna save before I do it because, yeah. Birkin fight? Birkin? Not Birkin? Night plug. What other night plug? Oh, it's after you get all the plugs, isn't it? Um, um, that was a waste of a save then. I'm gonna have to- no, I'm gonna have to no clip because I- I, I I literally have no choice. Yeah, there's zombies outside the fucking door. Okay. I should be able to open this door now, right? No, because it's locked on the other side. I'm gonna kill all- actually, I, I don't trust them to not block doors anymore. So I'm just gonna kill all of them. Okay. Where- Why are you in here? See, that shouldn't be able to do that, because that stays up there, but because it's an underline, it can just fucking jump over the barrier, so... Uh, I should be able to unlock that. Good, I don't think I need to go up there again. So, it must be something on that side, then, that I've... Oh, I remember. Wait, what? I remember there's a door that opens and zombies get released, but I don't remember where that door is. Is it through here? Oh, no, I think it's... At the bottom of this area, isn't it? I've just fucked myself by doing that, I think. I don't have a gear though, right? Uh, I am so comfy. I don't remember where I'm supposed to go now. Oh, actually, I might know where it is, actually. Hold on. It could be this room right here. Yeah, it's this one. Okay. Uh, oh, that's the gear. Uh,. That's the gear. This is so hard to figure out what the fuck is going on because there's no, there's no like notification text. There we go. A wheel. Okay, so that's everything I needed from there then. Huh? Uh... 
Ah, oh, there we go. Now it's worked. Yeah, and that happens then. I am definitely supposed to fall down there, but... Um... Actually, I think that's a... I think that takes you directly where you need to go, actually. So, yeah, this takes you back down here. Save it again. And now there should be the Birkin fight. It's just a poison zombie. Thank you. And that's the end of the chapter. Good. I wonder if they're gonna make uh, one of the later Birkin farms in Endline Guard. Because that would be fucking hilarious. And I can totally see them doing that. Uh, okay, so it's the sewers now. That is some funky looking water. That... Uh, I didn't realise that uh, gay water existed. Uh, I probably should save. But at the same time, I'm living on the edge, so fuck it. Also, I have faith in uh, my ability to not die to basic Half-Life enemies. What the fuck is that reflection? Oh, I wonder what they're gonna do with- There's supposed to be, like, spiders in here, right? I guess maybe nothing, but- Oh, I did not mean to jump on top of you. This is so much more awkward because of the water. Because it's pushing me up and then can swim in it. Which is really fucking annoying. Uh, uh? Why does it remind you of Cryo Fear? Uh, it is kind of Cryo Theory, actually. I think it's the hands, maybe. Yeah, I think it's the hands that are kind of like Cryo Fear. That's what it is. That is not where I would have expected that to go. I, I've never actually played Cryo Fear. I've, I've seen it, but I just haven't played it. Uh, where the hell is the other medallion? I played a, like quite a bit of the remake and then I only played the uh, original game once, so I'm more familiar with the remake version of the sewers than this version, but... I mean, to be fair, the, the PD in the original game is also uh, quite different, but it's close enough that- why am I crouched? It's close enough that, like, it it's not a huge deal. Why the fuck is even medallion? I... I know that needs to move down, uh, but wait, it is in- why wasn't that working before? Okay, sure, whatever. Sure, what, whatever, sure, cool, okay. We'll go over there. That's what I want to sit down, I want to see if I could open that, but sure, I'll save it. Do I want this to go up? Maybe? Sure, probably. Yeah, this is the crocodile bit. Where's- what is the crocodile? Oh shit, it's an actual crocodile! It's a really badly made crocodile! <laughs> oh my god! This is the greatest thing I've ever s That's a metal texture for its mouth. I, I know what texture that is. I've seen that texture in so many different places. It's even reflective. Yeah, that's a metal texture. Oh, this is so creative, but at the same time, it looks so stupid. The claws of the floor as well are a similar texture to it. Oh, I, I, have to, I, have to, I have to give them credit, or oh, have made this credit for actually, like, being so creative with the, lim with the limitations they had, but at the same time, it doesn't look very good. Why? I hate that so much. I hate how the water makes you jump up out of it. That is so fucking obnoxious. Like, if the water was lower, that wouldn't be a problem. But stop it. <laughs> stop it. Please. Like, if it was just lower down, they wouldn't do that. Oh, this is the train. Uh, okay. Is there a Birkin fight on the train? I don't know if there's a Birkin fight on the train or not. Oh no, this is where he goes through the roof, isn't it? 
Yeah, I remember. Oh, I can just crouch. Yeah, this isn't really planned very well. Wait, that's damaging me? The fuck? Also, again, very janky hands. I can guarantee the actual, uh... The actual thing won't look anything like that. Is that the only one going up? Okay. Oh, there we go. Is there a barking fight here or am I... What does that do? Huh? I have... No idea what that's for. Yeah, I, re I remember this hallway from, um... Actually, from my actual playthrough of it. Because I, I'm pretty sure like I was on low health at this point, so I, I couldn't really go down this way because there were just too many zombies and I didn't want to risk dying. So I finally get to see what's down here. Uh, shotgun ammo. Great. It was probably a, a shotgun upgrade that I missed then. That's probably what it was. The pistol is a, a Beretta, but Leon's was a BP70, I believe. So that's. But that, I mean, that literally could have just been fixed by getting a different pistol model, but yeah, sure, that's not a huge deal. Uh, that's the right way, so... It's over here. Health and that's it. Cool. More ammo. Ring ribbon. I want to say there is a Birkin fight, like, right here. Oh no, no, this is where the first... Is this where the first Mr. X? Interaction is in Leon's playthrough? I don't remember. Uh I'm gonna I'm gonna save it anyway, just to be safe. But no, because you need the key, right? Oh, it's right there. Oh no, because this is the No, this is the Birkin fight, I believe. When it starts going down, that's when the Birkin fight starts. God, it's been so fucking long since I've I fucking played this. I barely remember what, what am I what am I interacting with? What am I interacting with? Uh, not that. I. That? No. Uh, oh, there we go. Okay, it just wasn't doing it before. Or do I use that now? There we go. No, okay, now I use that. Right. Oh, cutscenes! This is the first one! <laughs> Birkin? Birkin fight? I swear there's a Birkin fight. I swear there's a Birkin fight here, but I might be misremembering. That might be in the other the other play for it on the other scenario. Which isn't in this, I don't believe. I don't know. If, I don't actually. I don't actually know if there is another scenario to this. Oh, no. This is in fact just the. Oh no, no. It's a, it's a, it's a poison zombie again. Okay, can I jump over that? No, I'm actually gonna have to kill that poison head crab than I. Oh. All right. Well, uh, one, one poison head crab? Sure. Wow. I swear there's supposed to be a bit before the elevator where, like, you go down, like, a minute and tunnel and, like, Mr. X is there? Am I? Is, is that not? Is that not in Scenario A? Is that, that might only be in Scenario B. That's, I think that's only in Scenario B. Never mind. Okay. It's gonna work. Lab? We doing lab now? This should be the final map then. Oh, and I'm over here now. <laughs> okay. Umbrella. 
Menshaft, God, I I absolutely adore the design of uh, the design of this. That's from CSS. Uh, the design of this version of the lab compared to the one in compared to the one in um the remake. I, like the, the remake's lab is cool, but it's just like it just it feel like this just feels more more Resident Evil to me. Just grungy industrial lab. I don't know. That just feels more more right. East area. Yeah, I don't remember what to do for any of this, and because there's no like text or anything, this is probably gonna be really awkward. Fuse guess. Well, it's literally right there. Okay. There's the main fuse. Wait, that's it? Okay, sure, why not? And then that is. Power sword. Yeah, it's just the two side areas, isn't it? As opposed to, I think, three in the remake? Uh, okay. Yeah, okay. So I have to do the other side first, I believe. Uh, honestly, if I hadn't played the original Resident Evil 2, I would have no clue what the fuck I was doing. Come on. That's zombies. Okay. There's a shotgun. And I'm full on hanging him Cool. Uh, yeah, there's nothing else here. That should blow up, right? It does something. I don't remember what it does. Oh, what? Uh... Okay, I wasn't ready to just interact with that and be teleported into a room with two, uh... That's first... Actually, what are the supposed to be? I swear there's no liquors in this section. Is there? Might be. I don't remember. It's been ages, but yeah. I swear there aren't supposed to be liquors in there. Maybe there are. Was there any point in actually going in there? Ah, oh, long ladder. Long ladder. Water frill. Cool. <laughs> Actually, I'm pretty sure there are liquors in this room, so that's that's right. Never mind. Uh, trying to save that storage. Yeah, this is the ending of the game, right there. I'm surprised that they actually did recreate the whole game, though. That's really impressive to me. Uh, I was about to say there should be a save room here. Uh, I haven't used like the revolver or the SMG at all because the shotgun and the pistol have been more than enough. Yeah, I'll just walk around you. Never mind, I'm not walking around you anymore. Yeah, I'm just gonna walk around you. See, th these rooms are big enough that it doesn't really matter too much. Uh, there's a key card. Oh yeah, you need something for that letter, I believe. Uh, I believe that's everything in here that I can do right now then. Just that key card. I want to check what's over here. Oh wait, this is the... What the fuck? Why are the headcrabs now? Yeah, this is the... Oh, I see, they're being birthed from the eggs. That makes no sense, but sure. Why the fuck? I can barely fucking see him. It's too dark. What? Oh, are these supposed to be like the spiders or something? These might be supposed to be the spiders, is what they're supposed to be. You know, I, I wouldn't have gone with head crabs, I don't think, first, but I would have gone with fast head crabs, I think. Um, just because they seem more spidery than regular ones. Oh, we're doing this again. Yeah, and lions as Lucas doesn't really work because you can't do the uh, the whole walk slowly and they won't attack you thing. <laughs> that doesn't really it doesn't really work too well unless that is a thing and I just haven't been able to test it because I've always been running around as they've dropped in and spawned in. But so it was the key card that I just picked up. So nope, not that. Fuck, I don't remember where I need to go. Have I done this right? Have I gone the wrong way? Is that what I've done? Okay, it's not over there. I must have gone the wrong way. That's the only thing I can think of. I swear you're supposed to use that computer that I tried interacting with. Uh, is there anything over here that I've missed, actually? 
This is one of the exit areas. Uh, no, it doesn't look like it. So I don't think I can do anything on the blue side yet then. Uh... Oh no, it's... No, it's that door, I remember now. Uh, those two are gonna get up, 100%. Can I use that one? No. There's the MO disc. I don't remember what you need the MO disc for. Th see, this is why this is why it needs the um it needs the uh, the text, the uh inch the sort of readable text stuff. Because without it I have no clue what the MO disc is used for, and I've played this before. But only once. I've only played it all the way through once before, but I've played this before and I don't remember what the MO disc is for. So I I, I I struggle to understand how anyone who has never um, played the original Resident Evil, 2, Resident Evil 2 before would figure out what they're supposed to do without any kind of, like, instructions. Wait, what? Wait, is that it? Am I done? Oh yeah, I forgot I can just drop off the ladder and then grab onto it at the last second. Uh, actually, can I just run? Yeah, okay. Cool. Well, yeah, I'm actually just done. I I don't know what the fuck I did. I honestly don't. <laughs> oh, there's actually a timer. And also the final book invite. Where'd the timer go? I didn't save. If I die, if I die, I'm. I, w I fucking called it. I said, I said one of the Birkins was gonna be an online guard. I fucking called it. I knew one of them would be because of how, like, how Birkin fights later in the games. He just charges at you a lot, and that's what the online guard does. It's perfect. I fucking knew it. Ah, uh, I'm both disappointed. And amazed that I knew that that I'd be right about that. I'm lying guard Birkin. Saw it here first. <laughs> Fucking hell. Oh, four minutes. Oh, it shows every minute, that's what it does. How much health do I, I didn't lose that much? Uh Is that it? That's a step animation, yeah. Fucking antlion guard Birkin. Again. I definitely feel like I should have saved though before this, just because if I run out of time, I don't think it's gonna happen, but if I run out of time, I'm kinda of fucked. I'm gonna have to use the SMG now as well instead because I just realized there's been no Mr. X since I played. Mr. X doesn't show up in the first playthrough, does he? No, no. It's Birkin only, I believe. Three minutes. Oh uh, crap. I feel like I might actually not have enough time. Wait, why can't I open that? Oh god, I might actually run out of time. Wait, is that it? You don't have to do any of the trend stuff, it's just you're done. Oh. I feel like a lot was cut out of the labs. No, there was definitely a lot of stuff cut out of the labs. Wait, that's it? That's it? That... That... There was... See, I was surprised by how quickly the detonation time started because there's supposed to be like a bunch more stuff you're supposed to do. But... None of that stuff happened, and it just ended. Like, you could see me trying to mess with that gate door because you're normally supposed to do stuff with that. And there's like a whole bunch of like other stuff that you're supposed to do, but it just, it just ended. Uh... Okay. <laughs> okay. Um, yeah, I think I'm mad. Uh, 
You're welcome. Um, that was very unusual. Like, the police department was like fully done. The well, apart from like the Ada stuff and like the cutscenes, but that's just because there's no Ada, I guess. Yeah, that was that was strange. I, I was expecting the lab to be longer, and like even before that, like around the end of the sewers, there was stuff that was just missing. The sewers didn't feel that long either, but I don't I don't think they were that long in the original game either. God, how much longer is this ending? It's just one word scrolling across the screen. Oh my god, it's still going. <laughs> it's definitely unusual, um, given that all the enemies are still Half-Life 2 enemies and the lab is like only half the lab for some reason. That was strange. Uh, the first half was definitely better than the second half, I think, just because it actually felt more feature complete. But even then, the bits that weren't really, even then the bits that were complete, there was no, there were, there were no like text entries or anything, so you just had to either already know roughly what you were doing or just kind of hope for the best or go off of interaction text alone, which was not great. Yeah, I don't know if I'd really recommend this to be honest. As like a fun curiosity, it's uh, it's it's fine. But as like a proper way of playing Resident Evil 2, it's kind of weird. Ah, oh, Fast Friends were presented by default. Hold on, I, I kind of want to check now. Uh, I was going to say, does it have custom icons? But no, it doesn't. They don't even have names, holy shit. Also, I swear to God, all of these weapon models are ripped from something else. I've seen this knife before. I've definitely seen this knife before. I've definitely seen this pistol before in like... I want to say this is like a really, really fucking old Half-Life 2 pistol replacement because I remember seeing this for Gary's mod in like 2009 and it's not even the right weapon. The shotgun is, uh, god, it's, uh, it's something. It's just basically two cylinders and a rectangle pretty much. Um, I, I want to say this is the only model that was made for this mod because it, it, it doesn't look on par with the rest. And even then this knife, I swear I've seen this knife as a crowbar replacement in like 2009 as well. This. I want to say this Desert Eagle is also a... Uh, I've s I swear I've seen this model before, or at least something similar to it. Then again, it's a Desert Eagle, so it kind of looks sad. And this SMG is... The view model is so outlandishly different. Like, it's so close to the screen. This has to be pulled from somewhere else. That might also be like a, a Gary's Mod thing, or something made for like something really old that I'm, I'm just not aware of, but... I want to say I've seen a model similar to this before as well. And it just, it looks so out of place. None of these models look like they fit together. <laughs> the knife is kind of like weirdly flat and it just doesn't look very knifey. The pistol isn't right and it's from a really old pistol replacement from Half-Life Half -Life 2. The shotgun looks nothing like the rest. <laughs> this just looks, this, this almost looks too high detail compared to the rest, I think. Because this SMG and this pistol have like, like they're decently detailed, but they still have that kind of like early Half-Life 2 mod kind of like level of polish to them where it's like, they're still like a little bit low poly enough that it's just, you can tell that they, they're, they're not very, I mean, maybe the texturing actually, I'm not sure what it is, but there's just something about them that looks slightly off to me, I'm not sure what it is. That's always been the case for stuff like this though from like the early days of Half-Life 2 modding and stuff like that. And then this Desert Eagle is just super shiny, high poly, high detail. It just, it, none of these weapons look, look right together, which is strange. You know, I wonder, I wonder if, it's a plus attack two, isn't it? Yeah. Bind L. I wonder if the shotgun still has a secondary fire. It does. It still has a secondary fire. Okay. Oh, and that still has grenades. It's just you can't use them because it's unbound. Is that what the unused is for? It is. Why not just remove? It's not used in the game, so why not just remove it instead of calling it unused? I'm so. Con this is such a confusing mod. I, I genuinely, I, I'm so confused playing it. Like I said, as a curiosity, it's really cool and really impressive. But it's just it's so it's so bizarre. I just I, I I wouldn't genuinely recommend playing it like for a reason of actually playing it. It's just I would recommend it as if you wanna see someone remake Resident Evil 2 in Half-Life 2, here you go.
That's the only reason I would recommend it. Yeah, really, really bizarre. <laughs> it's exactly as both good and bad as I hoped it would be. It's that perfect mix of uh, of modding. This is impressive, but also it's not very good. Anyway, I'm I'm I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna head off. Uh, definitely recommend playing it if you're interested. I wouldn't recommend playing it as like a way of legitimately playing Resident Evil 2, obviously, because it's it's very bizarre. <laughs>